Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and in this video I will be talking about biopsy and steroids. So I will not be talking about biopsy in detail, I will just be talking about a biopsy in terms of patients who are getting steroids. So what do we do in biopsy? See, we take out a small tissue or draw out some fluid and we basically try to diagnose or confirm the clinical or the radiographic findings of a lesion. It also helps us in determining the type of treatment and it also helps us in determining the prognosis of any kind of lesion. So very briefly, when do we advise biopsy? So biopsy in a dental patient, whenever we see anything suspicious, be it a soft tissue lesion or be it a bony lesion, during that time, we advise for biopsy. So with regard to the oral soft tissues, if we see any lesion you know, which is persisting for greater than two weeks, even after removing the cause of the lesion, then take a biopsy of that lesion. So koi bhi lesion, jo ki do hafte se zada patient ke muh mein hai, jab aapne primary jo cause hai, us uh, lesion ka usko hata diya uske bawajood agar wo do hafte se zyada persist karta hai to humko biopsy advise karni hoti hai then when it comes to the heart tissues to any kind of bony lesion which you cannot diagnose radiographically which you are not sure and moreover it has caused any kind of uh, local alterations or is has resulted in pain or has resulted in secondary changes in the oral cavity needs to undergo biopsy. Then in the oral cavity there are some contraindications to biopsy to wherever there are bleeding disorders or to whenever there is proximity to the local structures where there is any kind of lesion which is you know close to the nerves and close to the blood vessels in those cases we try to restrict ourselves from performing the biopsy. Coming to the main topic of today, in most of the red and white lesions that we come across or vesicobullous lesions that we come across, so whenever we take a history of the patient, mostly the patient is on topical steroids. So in such patients, you feel that there is some part of the lesion which is suspicious and you want to take a biopsy of some area in the oral cavity. So in such cases, it is very, very important that you should ask the patient to, if they are on topical steroids, to stop the topical steroids at least one month, you know, if not one month, at least 15 days prior to taking biopsy. So if you feel, if it's not feasible to stop the topical steroids for one month, you can decide the site of biopsy. You decide kar sakte hai ki kahan se aapko biopsy lena hai. And you can tell the patient to uh, keep applying steroids in all the other places and prepare that particular site for taking biopsy. So, us jaga pe, jaha pe aap ek, leash, ek site decide kar sakte hai. Agar aap stop nahi kar sakte hai steroids, patient ke condition deke, to aap site of biopsy determine kar sakte hai. Or site of biopsy determine karne ke baad, आप पेशेंट को बोल सकते हैं कि क्योंकि आप यहां से टिश्यू लेंगे इसलिए आप वहां पे पेशेंट को एक महीने तक मेडिसिन टॉपिकल स्टेरॉइड अप्लाई करने के लिए मना करेंगे इफ नॉट 30 डेज एट लीस्ट 15 डेज यू शुड अवॉइड अप्लाइंग स्टेरॉइड्स इन दैट प्लेस सो द रीजन फॉर दैट इज दैट स्टेरॉइड्स आर एंटी इंफ्लेमेटरी इन एक्शन सो इफ द पेशेंट इज ऑन टॉपिकल स्टेरॉइड्स it may alter the histologic nature or the inflammatory infiltrate which is there at the site of taking biopsy and it may also lead to false negative results. So that brings us to the end of the video. So if you want biopsy to be covered in detail, I would be covering that in a separate video. So if you've liked the video, do hit the like button and don't forget to share. And thank you so much for watching. Thank you.